The Columbus Blue Jackets have done the unimaginable. Somehow, some way, despite being down multiple times in our series versus the Red Wings, we have found our way into round two. Playing these playoff games is absolutely terrifying because you don't know on any given night if we are going to win by seven goals or lose by seven goals. However, in the biggest of games, game seven, we came out and put on the performance of a lifetime, ultimately taking down the Detroit Red Wings nine to two but now begins the blue jackets revenge tour in 2019 the blue jackets swept the president's trophy tampa bay lightning then went on to round two where they had to face the boston bruins unfortunately despite all the hype of the sweep we did ultimately lose to boston with a series score of four to two that means that this series right here right now is to make history not only is it the columbus blue jackets revenge tour over boston we are now set to make history and go the furthest the blue jackets have ever gone so will we make history or will we go up in flames let's find out looking at boston's lineup here they really didn't make any crazy changes at the trade deadline or anything like that obviously you have the usual guys leading the charge with pasta eight points in six games and marshawn seven points in six games our goal for the first two games of this series is to get into this man's head i'm gonna be the rat to the rat let's get into game number one here we go. National Anthem goes live here before our first playoff game here in round two. Now, we know historically how this has went. We know what we have to do. We are going to set the tone, not only in the pace of the play, the goal score, but also the physical play. We are going to come out here and lay the biggest bodies that this world has ever seen. Okay, we cannot let the first goal in. You know if we let in the first goal against Boston, it's, it's game over. All right, so we're going to... What is Tarasov doing in that? Elvis just played the game of his life in game seven. And we are putting a guy who has never sniffed the playoffs in his first game in round two against Boston. What is going on here, coach? Okay, well, this is just uh, this is just added a little bit of complexity to this series. We're gonna have to play the best defense that this world has ever seen. Like, let's let's be honest with ourselves. We don't have the Allmark Swayman combo with Tarasov and Elvis. That's that's just not a thing. Like, this is one of... I mean, Tarasov's kind of dialed, though. I'm not gonna lie. We are three and a half minutes into this game. <laughs> we have we have not touched the puck. They have 18 shots on net. Please get us off the ice. We haven't... Okay, I was gonna say we haven't won a face-off either. We, we finally did get our face-off, and we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna do a little dump and chase. You know what, Mac? Okay, nice move. Nice, hey, nice move. That's on me. Yep, feed me Johnny. Here we go. Okay, we got wheels. Hey, we might not get many shots. But we are going to go down and make the most of our opportunities behind the net. Little... Ref! Dude, I'm literally... I, I flopped three times. <gasps> nice shot there by Rusty. Nice save there. Who do they have in net right now? Is that Allmark? We're going to take a look when we can see. Yup. What a save. <gasps> okay, we have full pressure. Boys, this game has turned around one shift at a time. Severson, you better win that battle to a guy that is absolutely gassed. It's been on the ice for eight minutes like us. And I got to get off the ice. Okay. We we get back to the game. 42 seconds left. We are in the power play. We are also down one. So in the first period, just, just to set the matter straight, we have our backup goalie in net, and we have our first line playing a total of two shifts. Okay, big back check there by Rusty. We will at least get back here. I'm going to take Marshawn out of the play. Boom! Okay, I cannot even bump Marshawn in the slightest. We're down one after one. Not a terrible period, but we haven't laid a single hit. And we've missed two to three good opportunities in front of the net. Allmark is going to be one that's going to cause some issues. Okay, so, so far we've laid about half of a bump on uh, on Marshawn. That's the biggest hit that we've laid this period. Nice little play there, Russ. Nice. All right, Johnny, feed me that puck. I'm going to go back door. Yep. <gasps> what a shot. God, but Kent can't get it to go either, dude. Allmark is playing out of his mind. Okay, we got to be quicker with our shifts. I'm not trying to actually have only two shifts per period, so we're going to get off. What a save, Terrace. All right, Terrace is playing decent, all things considered. Are you kidding me, dude? First of all, it's been 13 minutes. We're back on the ice. Second of all, we're down by three. I'm telling you, boys, it is literally every other game. We either win big or we get destroyed. There is no in-between. No OTs, no close games. Every, every, our AI are throwing. What is going on? It's all mental, boys. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now, we are going to score this shift. We're going to make it 3-1, heading into the third period. Get the momentum, turn this game around. Rusty is spinning. 
What is that? What is that bump, dude? I make a perfect move. Still get bumped off the puck. Rusty is out here grinding. Yep. Yep. Couple good chances. We just can't get that puck on our stick. I'm trying to chase down those rebounds. Uh, I see KJ up there. I'm actually going to take it in myself and try to fire this. Oh! Oh, dude. Almost just toss that puck right to us almost we're down by three after two we've had our chances Omar is just an absolute brick wall back there so we get one goal the floodgates open up we'll be back in this here in period three let's try to actually get some pressure going here too we really we have not set up pressure at all oh hold on hold on yep. no way he makes that did he make that save or did that get blocked if he made that save dude Omar is going to be a major major problem okay another good rush yep feed me johnny okay johnny three zero just give us some hope Four to zero with eight minutes left. I know that was a little bit of a force. It's just when you're this. They, they're not calling that off. It, this might be the worst call I've ever seen in this game. I don't even think they're reviewing this right now. He legitimately cross checks Tarasov in the face. His blocker and glove go in the air. Is this getting reviewed or not? And it's not getting reviewed. There is no way. That is legitimately the worst call I have ever seen in this video game. Five to zero off a blatant goalie interference. We're getting robbed. The referees are against us. The players are against us. The game is against us. Do you need proof that this game is predetermined? I, I think you now have it. Um, truthfully, one of the most unbelievable things I've, I've ever witnessed. Obviously, we got robbed on the other end. Obviously, we weren't going to win this game. But for them to call no goal interference, not even to review the play, when we get two-handed to the face, glove and blocker fly into the air, Tarasov's bent backwards at a 90-degree angle, and there's no call on the play. It is unbelievable what I just witnessed. The final score of game one here in round two, five to zero. When we look back at what happened in this game, you know, we had our chances. In, in period number one, shift number one, I think we had three or four good chances there on all mark can't get any of them to drop then they come back we go to the bench two goals go into the net another goal goes into the net and then the goal interference of a lifetime goes into the net good news is we have a chance to bounce back here in game number two if we go down 0-2 versus boston it's series over there is no coming back so let's make history let's get back into this game tie this series at one well desperate times call for desperate measures whatever gets me the most body checking and we are going to put it on right here right now hold on a second for three hundred and seventy five thousand dollars we get a personal security personnel plus one body checking plus two defensive awareness this is what we are going we got a security guard following rusty around from this point forward and I have $6,000 left to my name. Good thing is, that's all I need. <laughs> Let's go. Not only do we have the security guard, we're also getting ferocity here. Body checking, aggressiveness, and fighting skill all going up as well. Also get straight up body checking up. So we got a three-point boost to body checking. Now at an 89, we should be able to lay some booms out here. Looking at our scores from around the league, Nashville up one, Dallas up one, the Capitals up one, and of course, Boston up one. So shaping up to be a good one here. Let's get in to game number two another thing to consider is the home ice advantage so in our last series every game except game seven every single home team won every single game so could the same thing be applying here maybe maybe we'll get some momentum when we go back home but we have the opportunity to break that trend right here right now rusty i just got absolutely launched by a freight train and we still have Tarasov in net. I don't know. Maybe Elvis got injured. Is that the only way that we can explain what happened here? I have no clue. Also, I accidentally just laid a reverse check into no one. And they're going to they're gonna come out and score. This is the biggest shift of my career. That's how we're going to treat it. Here we go. Okay, it's not the biggest shift of Ken Johnson's career. We can't get a draw to save our life. <gasps> oh, okay, we, hey, we got the jump cheese from Archenko. This is when goals go in. Every single time there's a big jump, a goal goes into the back of the net. Watch this. I told you, boy, every single time there is something built into the game. When a big jump happens on the other side of the ice, a goal goes into the back of the net. What a cut from Rusty. What a rebound from Jack. And we are back in this series, boys. Let's go. You can't make this stuff up, dude. I knew the second that puck got caught, we were going to score. The second it happened. Dude, this game is so weird. What other game can you play where you know when a guy jumps in the air that a goal is going into the back of the net? It's crazy. 
We have to celebrate for approximately six seconds before our vibe is ruined. Marshawn, of course, is the one to bury the goal. We're at 1-1 here. And you know what? We got we got a little 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 flare out of Rusty. Oh! <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I shot that puck top left. I heard it bounce off of something or someone and i think it was the defender in front of the net i tried to fire that i thought i sniped it barred out top left and then i saw the puck go in on the i have no idea where that puck just went but holy we are buzzing 2-1 all right we have our lead can we keep the lead for more than six seconds we have i'm gonna i'm gonna do shorter shifts here i want to get more shifts versus being out there longer i'd rather have green bars where we can at least make something happen Ooh, nice pass there by Johnny. We're going to make a quick move, and I am going to get off the ice here. I'm going to be smarter. I'm going to be way smarter with my shifts. We'll get three to four good shifts a period. And of course, I go to the bench for 30 seconds. I trust line two for just 30 seconds, and another goal goes in against us. 2-2 two, two after one. I don't know what to do. I'm buzzing right now, though. Yep, feed me. Good look there. Little toey. That was disgusting. Oh, that goes in. Oh, we got a couple lucky bounces. 2-2, two, two, we're heading to the bench. Let's go. Okay. We finally got one goal from, from line 2-3-4 two, there. We now have a 3-2 lead. Okay. Oh, was that was that a catch? It was. I don't know if it was a good enough catch for this to be an auto goal. We'll see. Hold on. If he gets me back door. Oh, Johnny kind of had the lane. It popped open there at the last second. Not quite. Okay, we have somehow held on to a lead for four minutes, which is a miracle in and of itself. We have a 3-2 hockey game. We got the lead. We got the momentum. We score one more goal here. I think this, this game might be done. All right, Rusty's going to be the one to do it. Let's pop off here in period number three. Okay, good win there. Kent Johnson's finally starting to win some draws. I'm just going to rip... Rip it right in his head. I'm coming back door. Ew, what a feed from Johnny. Yes, sir. Finally, Johnny makes a pass across, dude. He's been forcing those all day long. And one of them has gotten through. Luckily enough for us, we find the back of the net. We are now up to. If we throw this game away, we might as well throw the entire series away. Rusty gets behind them and finds the back of the net. We're going to minimize theirs for him. I think we have our two goal lead. We don't need to get super aggressive here. We just play our game. Keep on pushing but we don't have to do anything crazy. We've got the tilt in our favor here. If that would have went in, you just know it's predetermined. Here, <laughs> You just know. I'm going for a tip. Yep. Oh, he tried to feed me there. I actually like that look. We almost have full pressure. We can get it, and we will not. Okay, we got the puck. I'm going to... Yep, we'll get it over to Johnny. I'm going to cut down low. Feed me, Johnny. Yep. Bang. Good look. That, that's a... I mean, that's just our play. I feel like we've scored countless goals with that play right there. Get off the ice here. Hopefully, no goals against. Okay, this is where it gets scary. We have full pressure against us. They score here. They're coming back for sure. Nice save there by Tarasov. Get that puck out. Feed me. And we dump it low. Yep, perfect. We'll take that all day. I'm getting off the ice. I've got no energy left. Okay, three minutes. This is probably going to be our last shift of the game. They're going to go empty netter too. So if we can just bury this empty netter. Empty netter. Little, little hattie in the playoffs for Rusty. Why not? Why not me? Covering back door. Yep. Perfect defense there by Rusty. I know I'm playing a bit lower, but we have this pressure against us. We can't move. And there we go. I mean, you could feel it was coming. They've had pressure on us the last two shifts in its entirety. As uh, they make a nice quick pass play, fire it on the backhand. A bit of a disrespectful selly there from Sprong 2. I mean, you don't need to go down to two knees here. I mean, it's, it's a playoff game and you're down, but to each their own. Okay, coach did pull us from the ice, which means we are going to have to sit on the bench here and watch the last minute. Unless, I, I think we will get back out there if we do get a whistle. We'll see when this goalie pulls here as well. 40 seconds, no goalie pull yet for Boston. What are they doing? Hold up, Boston is actually throwing. 15 seconds. Okay, here's, here's going to be the goalie pull. 13 seconds left. Boston walking in. Goalie pull comes out. A two-on-one. Where is our defense? What is... What a save by Tarasov. Okay, last five seconds. Coach, get me out of that ice right now. Okay, we are on the ice. We're going to play defensive, but if I have a chance to boom a clapper down there, I'm, I'm playing out for the shot. Yep. Let's go, boys. We have survived game number two. Rusty putting his body on the line at the end of that game, dude. I, and that shot snuck by my skate. I was in a good spot to block three-fourths of the net. Tarasov had the other fourth. So a big game there from the Columbus Blue Jackets. We got off to a hot start. Definitely had a couple lucky goals, I'll be honest. The, the sneak past the defenders to, to throw it to that left side. And then the puck that bounced off three different bodies ended up to the back of the net. Sometimes it's just how it's going to go. We got to just keep shooting the puck. The goals will come.
calm. We've now broken the home ice curse as well. We got our win in their barn. We're heading back to Nationwide Arena tied at one. That's all we can ask for. And you know what? Rusty is starting to heat up at the perfect moment. Taking a look at our scores around the league. Nashville up 2-0 over the Wild. Dallas up 2-0 over the Canucks. And over in the East, we have a 1-1 tie between the Devils and Capitals. And of course, the Blue Jackets and Boston. Every single episode of the playoffs so far has been absolute chaos. None more chaotic than what we saw today. I hope you guys enjoyed this. We are tied at one heading back home. If you did, hit the video with a like. Also, we just hit 900,000 subscribers. From the bottom of my heart, thank you to each and every one of you that tunes into my videos. Whether you watch these videos, the GoPro videos, or anything in between, it means the world to me. And you know what that means. The road to 1 milli is actually here. I know I've been saying it since like 500K, but now we are 100,000 subscribers away. So hit that subscribe button. More rusty content coming soon. More Heat Wave Arena content coming soon. We'll see you guys next time. And peace.